morning, I'm Kathleen Pate and this is my Alabama Farm Life. Today, I'm celebrating my one year anniversary on YouTube. One year ago, I learned how to drive a tractor, I took some video, I made a little film, and I posted it on YouTube. A lot of things have changed since that first video, and a lot of things have stayed the same. I am still learning how to drive that tractor, and I probably don't use it near as much as I should for what it was meant for. One of the things that I also noticed is that I had three roosters. I still have three roosters, but they're not all the same roosters. I'm going to go ahead and start this video by showing you my first video. It's here. you want it's here Good morning. What a blessed day. Hi, my name's Kathy. Welcome to my channel. It's just Kathleen Pate. I'm here in central Alabama. I am from South Florida where I have lived most of my life. This has come way earlier than I ever would have anticipated. I have been looking at tractors and I have been blessed with this gift. I have been given the use of this tractor. It's not mine, but I can use it as much as I need to, which is awesome because as you can see, there's a lot to be done on this farm and it's just me and my mother-in-law and my dog. So I've had to 
toned down everything that I've wanted to do. And so far it's just chickens and trying to grow things. And the spring hasn't been all that great. We did get some tomatoes, but I've been traveling back and forth from here to South Florida. So it, it's made it kind of hard. So right now I just have my chickens and I am starting my fall garden. I decided to start this channel because I wanted to show that you, me, an older, single, actually widowed female with her dog and her mother-in-law can have a homestead, can have a farm and, and do the things that they need to do to make, well, actually right now, just to get by, I'm hoping that by next year, that I'll be able to actually make a profit. But right now my, my goal is to repair, clean up, grow food to feed our family. And, and you can do that at any age. I'm 56 this year. I just retired last year. I was fortunate enough to be able to retire. Um, things of course did not go the way that things were planned, but that's life, life's hard and it's how we react to it and respond to it that gets us through it. So I hope that you come back by and visit my channel and see my adventures because boy, have I had some adventures. And I, I'm hoping that I can inspire women my age and younger because I have well I've sat here in the shade long enough in this field so again I hope you come back by and see me and share my adventures with me but I'm going to go back to driving around in this tractor because oh my god this is fun thank you I want to apologize for some of the audio when I was recording it. I, I don't know what happened. Some of the audio disappeared. But I went ahead and added the original music to it. So hopefully it was okay. I hope you enjoyed it. And I hope that you can tell the difference between my first video and my videos now. I do all my recording with my cellular phone. And when I first started out, I was using an i7, but I upgraded for Christmas and got an i12. I think my videos come out looking a little bit more professional. They're very crisp. Occasionally I do get some blurring, but, but otherwise I think the video on this phone comes out really nice. I want to discuss one of the reasons that I started this YouTube adventure. Yes, I wanted to inspire people, especially women like myself who may be widowed or single, older. You can homestead. You absolutely can homestead. Thankfully, I'm not by myself. I also have my mother-in-law and she is a wealth of information. She's taught me a lot, her and her brother George, they have both taught me a lot about farming this area and I really appreciate it. As I said, last year we didn't do so well. We got a few tomatoes and that was about it. But this year we've done a lot better. We got a lot of tomatoes. I've harvested a lot of cucumbers and I'm hoping to get some beans here pretty soon. I'm still waiting to see what the okra is gonna do. The deer keep eating it. I want to discuss other reasons why I started this YouTube channel. Of course, in August of 2020, we were right in the middle of this pandemic and I moved to a new city. I have no friends. I have a lot of family here, but they're pretty scattered. I don't think I realized how lonely I was when I started my YouTube channel. Looking back now, I know that I was very deep in my grief from the loss of my husband. He was my best friend. So I started talking to my phone. I literally talked to my phone for hours. 
And I also discovered that it was a awesome outlet because for some reason I couldn't write anymore. I've always been a writer. I've always journaled and I just couldn't write anymore. I just couldn't get my thoughts together. I was also having problems praying and meditating. I just, I just couldn't. Before I started my channel, I was watching tons of YouTube channels, and one of my favorites was The Crockers. I was watching Coffee with the Crockers in the morning with Jason, and he always spoke about not being afraid to start your own channel. So I did, and here we are. Starting this channel has been very therapeutic for me and actually one of the best things that I could have done for myself. I have met some really awesome people and I am so thankful for them every day. The homesteading community, along with several other communities on YouTube, have been absolutely fantastic. So here's to making new friends with people from new channels. And a big thank you for all those people and all my friends in my new YouTube family that just come and watch. I really do appreciate you all. So in celebration of one year, I wanna give away a t-shirt and a mug to two of my subscribers. All you have to do is go into the comments and say, I wanna win. And I will put you in for the contest of a t-shirt and a mug. I can't believe that it's been one year already and that you guys can be here to help me celebrate. I wanna thank you all so much for your love and support, but you guys, have a great day. It's time for me to get going. I've got a ton of stuff that I need to be doing because this basement isn't going to clean itself.